It's the official kickoff to the Morgan County Fair. Due to the effects of barrel, it's been raining though all day into the evening, forcing the main events to be moved indoors or rescheduled. Our Mackenzie Laporte was at the fairgrounds today and shares the team effort it took to still honor both the talent show and the pageant. That's right, guys. Now it is day one here at the Morgan County Fair in Jacksonville, Illinois. And despite the rain you see behind me, the preparation work is still going on and the fair is open to the public throughout the rest of the week, including tonight. Now, while events maybe won't be taking place on the grand stage you see behind me, the show will still go on. Tuesday was the official start to the Morgan County Fair, and even with the rainy conditions, volunteer crews on the ground say events are still up and running. The team effort is phenomenal. Everything is just kind of falling into place. Uh, we've always seem to deal with a little bit of precipitation during our fair. Uh, this year it happens to be on the first part of it, but uh, you know everybody just kind of comes together and we know we got to have a little, I'll call it detour. But uh, the show goes on and uh, everybody just comes together and does all the necessary work that we need. Hadden shared last summer the first day of the fair was bright and sunny. This year, the challenge is making sure the pageant and talent show still goes on. But it's, it's a little bit disheartening for the young ladies that are participating in the pageant. You know, they've practiced and everything on our big stage in front of the grandstand where a lot of family and friends can be there. I mean, we can hold 1,800 people in our grandstands. And it's just a great event out there on that big stage in front of so many people, family and friends. So unfortunately, they don't have that experience, but they're still going to get the experience. Now, while the rain was on everyone's mind Tuesday, intense heat is expected for the weekend. We asked how the fair plans to take care of their livestock. We've rewired almost all of our facilities over there. So everybody knows to bring fans, everybody knows we got plenty of water and so forth, and 90% of our livestock will leave Saturday afternoon. And with most of the livestock off the grounds before Sunday, Haddon believes the heat concerns won't be a problem. Reporting here in Jacksonville, I'm Mackenzie LaPorte. All right, thanks Mackenzie. If you didn't make it out to the fair due to the weather today, there are a ton of events for the whole family the rest of the week with a special salute the troop event tomorrow where there will be World War II tanks that will display their firepower. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.